So basically, this is a sea bird. It's like thousands of people that don't come back. So currently the first lady just got lands at the Wundi International Airport and of course we all follow and see the grand welcome we the first lady um, received from um, the people then waiting at Wundi and now a similar welcome and with her excellency Madam First Lady at this town as you can see this can see by this side we expect the first lady to arrive anytime soon we get hundreds and hundreds of people just coming in, the Tara riders, market women, and I will move for going on the other side so that um Pambu will see the kind heroes welcome where the people of Sierra Leone plan for the Excellency Madam First Lady today. We all know say Madam First Lady be going at the United Nations besides being successfully champion a UN resolution we make the world currently through the United Nations not declare November 18 as a day of commemoration for them picking them where people want for sexually tamper with. So this is the welcome that currently awaits from Her Excellency the First Lady where people from various forms of life they all there are so they don't large. They are eating, coming from the background. And then the personality from the other side. And then I also they wait for the first day. Wait for it to be in a day after the day. In all land and um, so then they say give good dollar. You know, so this is how they welcome this way. They wait for Madam First Lady. And of course, we're ready today for enjoy and for celebrate this kind of woman where we don't ever see that kind of people as soon as So this is it, it's a sea bird. Everybody's anxious, everybody will wait for Her Excellency, the first lady, wait for us to be in a and he will make the way to the Yeah.
I'm not even a huge fan of it. But it's not just a sample of what you can see where my is yoga for each child. So today, our sites, the Galionians, the various works of life, the high school is for welcome. What's the better way to welcome the first lady? I'm a little Cuba, I'm a little Cuba.
champion this building at the United Nations and the United Nations team say yes therefore pass on. this a like uh, the president of the uh, UN they say it's unprecedented where you get the whole um, G7 the whole of Europe the whole of Africa 
everybody voted for a resolution, a not common, you know. But um, I just want to say, Sierra Leone, we don't work very hard. The presidents really take gender issues seriously. And the world don't pay with back by saying they don't listen to what they do in this country. Yeah? And then they're ready for support. So we have a day, November 18th, as the World Day now. Um, um, of course, the first one winner uh, yesterday, we decide say, no, we, because a lot of victims, they also, the rape issues, not just for women, they want to man them also. So within the Catholic Church, there was a huge crisis because of the issue there. And so we thought the, the Vatican offers, say, let the one for do uh, a prayer for all the victims and, and survivors there in the Vatican. And uh, because me a champion this whole thing up to the UN level so I had to be in Rome also for the prayer and then we get a, an audience with the Pope for Leo we could say thank you also because the, the Catholic Church support Islamic relief support even when we get country they support but we also get institutions institutions the global institutions that we support this process we get they call them the global collaboratives now almost 47 of them internationally from america to japan to china to um, the middle east africa europe everybody will come on board and say yes this is a legitimate cause and this day we will definitely will forget about it. okay because as you say majority almost the whole world supporter and this is a big boost for Sierra Leone and the world as a whole so what do you think is the government all not support this uh, resolution? I think people are not tired for the see bad things that they have. Everybody knows the way you talk about rape. Rape is not a good thing. So I think people are not tired for that. And that's the reason that when they will make the, they don't take and make a priority say, you know what, we, if somebody they will talk about this issue, let we save, put we bless it into this and make sure say, we collectively we find a way for, for stop and go, for help as much as we can, for able for integrate and for help the survivors that heal. Because for rape, you can get justice, you know, not mean say you don't heal. We also need the day, and that day basically is a day to commemorate, it's a day for prayers, it's a day for forgiveness, it's a day where they will come together and talk about them or deal with them and know say they are not in this alone. Okay, uh, we know say we don't tire, but this last one, how this go? help for boost the hands of our girls campaign we don't they champion so much in this country well it just give me more hope and it tell me say yes the campaign the campaign where the world don't listen to um from the one and not say why would it change um, um the way we people and they think behavior the people and behavior in uh, your country you also don't forget the international community for support which you do so this is a clear uh, uh, manifestation where the United Nations don't show say then don't they listen, put in the hands of the girls they talk about, they understand and they want to be part of it. So I'm, I'm grateful to them, but I'm more importantly I'm grateful to Sierra Leone and I'm grateful to the government and especially the president because if he not been given the opportunity, not been given the free will for able for work and do the things the way they do, this or all of this not be possible. So most of this credit I gave to President Pio because now he see the need who put me at the front say I want you to champion this. And this come at a time where, you know, everything just coincides. We don't fetch with the gender bill now, parliament for all these years. And then we get this resolution at the United Nations. A few days later, the gender bill does not pass on our parliament. That they say, the, you know, we're listening. We, 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 we definitely Sierra Leone, Sierra Leone already for, for, for move on and, and do the right thing for this country. Thank you so much, Madam President, Thank and you. welcome back. Thank you. God bless you. Of course, that's now be a brief interview where the AYV Media Empire will get with Her Excellency, the First Lady of the Republic of Sierra Leone. So, as we all do see now, Madam First Lady is in the Presidential Lodge, and um, I think we'll forget now some privacy and make you enjoy the rest of the moment. Um, she's been welcomed all over the place. Thank you very much.